Hi, I'm John Twist of University Motors, and this is our YouTube video for January, I think it's the 25th, it's Tuesday, and we're getting so close to getting our building ready for the inspectors to come by and, and give us the okay, at which point we're going to have to move in, which is going to take us another couple of weeks. So we are looking at the 1st of March for our opening. We painted the floor here. I don't even, cannot even tell that it's painted, but uh, we painted the floor on, on uh, Saturday and Sunday. It's an epoxy. Uh, I was on my hands and knees with a belt sander, so cleaning the floor with the, uh, with the belt sander, smoothing it out. Then we put down the epoxy, and then I, as I put down the second coat, I sprinkled sand, literally beach sand, into the epoxy and rolled that out so that it's got a nice rough uh, texture to it. Every, everyone, everyone has been very, very uh, concerned that if we have epoxy on the floor and we get oil and water on the floor, we're on our ass. And I'm, I'm too old to slip and fall. So uh, we thought if we put the sand in it, and a couple of guys had given us that idea, that it would make it really grippy. And it is. When you put your foot on it and try, try to turn your, your, your foot, it's, uh, it, there's, there's a, lot of, a lot of restriction because of the, uh, because of the sand. <clears throat> but it isn't going to be so easy to clean up now. And uh, if we put a squeegee on it, <laughs> it isn't going to work. So we're going to have to have a hose and a broom. I don't know. Our, our cleanup will be a lot different. We got our glass in. I'm not sure that, that was in the last time that we took the, the video with the our glasses in here. Of course, it's so clean it's hard to tell except for Casey's. Uh, um, where's this from, Casey? Your, your, oh, it's Muppets. The Muppets. Speaker. Anyone who's used to instantly recognizes it, but people my age are still. Uh, up front here, we've got almost all of our painting done. We're just we're filling in the, uh, doing the trim right now around the, around the windows. Uh, our back, our back uh, walls are, are a brown color, beige on the wall, off-white on the ceiling. Uh, anyway, the glass is all done up front here. Our floor is in. I know the floor wasn't in the last time that we took the, the video. So this is, uh, this is starting to look pretty nice. I'll walk around here. We've got a uh, fresh air grate, cold air grate, up against the wall here to, to a pull, pull the air in and go up to our rooftop heater. And so today, I hope our painting is going to be done today. We got Matt Portier down here with a paintbrush in hand. Don't don't wave the paintbrush. Just fill the paint, Matt. But <laughs> and Casey's over here painting, and and uh, Kurt is painting. Uh, yesterday, I painted the workbenches. Back on and see the workbenches back to the. I got the workbenches upside down, put a lot of oil based paint on those. Those have yet to be positioned and get metal tops and angle iron around the outside. I stopped into our old shop today at 6490 Fulton Street to see what that looked like, and it's like night and day. It's, uh, it's almost as great of a change in that building as it is in this building. Uh, oh my gosh, it's just altogether different. And we've got a sign right up there at the front door that said, this used to be University Motors because I know a lot of people will be stopping by there this summer unaware that, of course, that, that we've moved. Well, on our video on Thursday, we ought, to have, uh, we ought to have even more action, more stuff done. I want to remind you that um, I'll be at the British Motor Trade Association conference and in uh, Fort Lauderdale in a couple weeks. I'm going to be at the Chicago swap meet the, at the DuPage County Fairgrounds the last Sunday in February. And I'm going to be at Quality Coaches uh, mid, mid March, around the, sometime around the Ides of March. And if you want to attend the technical seminar there, be sure to call Val. Uh, or Mark at Quality Coaches in Minneapolis. We should have a really good time. Had a good time last year, we'll have a good time this year too. So until Thursday, thanks very much. Call me anytime, I'm happy to answer your questions. Uh, and um, we'll be back in, back in business for real, full time, 1st of March.